Okay, should be able to hear me now. Just let me set up a few things and then I'm basically good to go. We can think about what we will do today. Also, if you have any questions, feel free to ask. Also, don't know if the sound is okay. That is like an information I would uh, appreciate to know. Maybe I could make this a little bit uh, less loud. Sorry. Okay, that should be everything should be fine, at least in theory. What's going on here? Can I just get online? Mm -hmm. I won't have a Twitter conversation right now. But I got a little bit uh delayed, that the word. <laughs> oh boy, it's always interesting when you start a stream or need to talk to uh, talk English. My brain need, needs some warm up time. I don't know what it is, but it takes a few seconds for me to uh, get used to um, speak English again. I also have this nice or fitting ambient sound for the fire now, which is quite cool. Let's stop the music for now. Third official stream, that's amazing. Also wrote Dark Souls. I should try Strider Challenge in Dark Souls. That's potentially what we will continue doing today. And I have to think where we stopped. I haven't played any further, so you have missed nothing. Just doing all the social media stuff so people know that I'm now online. Also, Schreiber already said that he likes that I'm uh, online for a t uh, at a time for not Americans, which, because I don't live in the United States, I tend to be online at these times, so pretty much quite early. But sometimes we can go past 12, which would be a no more normal time for American viewers, I guess. But we will see. So maybe... Yeah, I've put this to loop. There's so much stuff going on in the background always when you stream. Checking that everything is fine. Checking social media, <laughs> checking the comment section in the on YouTube. Have to answer a few more comments, but uh, I caught up a bit because I last week I was a little bit lazy with comments, so a bunch of them piled up, and uh, to answer a lot, still have like one comment that is I don't know at least f several weeks or a conversation I probably could write an answer to, but I just didn't have the time yet. Maybe I will do this later. I don't know. We will see. So let's go straight to Dark Souls because why not? Playing a little bit Dark Souls always nice. Probably not the most <coughs> relaxing game but I really like it. It's one of my favorite games I would say. 
Also, it makes this sound every time I start it. Hopefully, that's because of the uh, DS fix. We will also play the. Uh, uh, well, I hope that this would turn out differently. Also, must change the recording part. What is it? Is it the game capture here? I captured a different game after that, so I have to set it back to Dark Souls and hope that it works. It works. Amazing. So we should be in the menu now. And there's still one little problem. I don't know if I can fix it. Should I try? Ah, we try. We just started, so it's no problem, I guess. Just restart Dark Souls really quick. I hope that it works this time. Because it, it did not hide my... Now it hides it. Uh, my Windows bar. I would also love to see um, the complete screen or all of the screen. Maybe I have to adjust my microphone a little bit, sorry. So what we do is we play as Strider through Dark Souls, so I'm only allowed to use Strider weapons, which is of course a broken sword because of uh, of Narsil that he carries around in the books. The film he does not, but uh, in the film he does carry um, a long sword. Why do we have two of them? Hmm. I have to I have to um, fix my inventory. There it is. <laughs> We also have a long sword, which you also use in the film. Maybe we upgrade this and use this as Anduril, the Flame of the West, with a fire upgrade, but I'm not sure yet what to do with it, or what weapon to use. Our best weapon, even though he rarely use it, uh, used it, I think, in the films at least, uh, we also have the bow. Also, I already, I already upgraded my Broken Straight Sword to plus 5. As you can see, it deals whopping 60 damage, so on plus 5, it does not even reach the Long Sword. And the Long Sword isn't even a good weapon in Dark Souls, so you can most likely foresee how this is going. Also, thanks to the guys who followed me in the last few days. You probably won't hear it, but I at least said it. So much appreciated. So let's let's do some fun things like cleaning up or tidy up your my inventory. I mean I also found the Black Knight Greatsword, which is cool, but probably not a very Aragorn weapon, <laughs> so I I won't use it. No, Aragorn wouldn't have used a catalyst, so this basically does not work. Target shield. I I want I want to have a, a what is it called a small sheet with a lot of parry frames. I mean, I don't know if Aragorn would have used shields like these, but probably. Wooden shield is weird. Should I keep it in inventory? I mean, I have, a, I have those two, so I would most likely use those two. Yeah, it makes no sense. It's quite funny, while, because I'm allowed to use a bow and we already bought a lot of arrows, we can do some cool stuff with it. Also, I have to get rid of my mouse cursor. Sorry. So we could go down here and go to the dragon because there's actually a very good shield. The dragon quest sh uh, crest shield, or is it the um, no? It's the dragon quest shield. The normal the normal quest shield uh, is found in the asylum, if I remember correctly. Oh no, I did it again. It's also not on six. I also play on sixty FPS, so my jumps aren't that as far. Um, yeah, here, here it is. We could with a bow. I think we could 
relatively easily kill, I would say cheese, but I mean, I'm using a bow, so why not? It's not like some forbidden tech or anything. It's in the game, and I'm actually playing a bow. We actually killed the gargoyles with a bow, which was fairly easy, to be honest. I was really surprised how well uh, we could destroy those guys. Well, this will, this will take a few arrows. Millions of years of evolution, but he can't move anymore. So I can just kill him. Because it makes no sense to attack him with a different weapon. I'm totally honest here, because... Look at him. Oh, look at my weapon options. They aren't great, so... Can make more damage? No. Maybe if I hit the head, it makes more damage. It makes less damage on the head. It could be because um, I'm too close. Oh, now we do more damage. There is a ring. I don't know where you get it that boosts your bow damage. Very inconsistent now. That's interesting. I think it's dependent on the range. So now he's further back, I do less damage. I know, it's uh, not very spectacular to kill him this way. By the way, you know, that's the other dragon, right? Where you have to just hit the foot several times and he falls off. Maybe I'm misremembering it. To update my information, it's always hard to see. And last shot. So now we have Aragorn, the Dragon Slayer. We have a sword that I also thought about. Um, first of all, we have this shield, which is amazing, at least against fire. It's the highest has a fire, uh, the highest fire resistance. Oh, this thing has more stability than this one. Still very good shield. Box 100%. It's not good against magic, though. And if we later find... Uh, not find, but fight... Our good old friend, the Four Kings... I still have no clue how to beat those guys with my weapon options that I currently have, but... We will look into it. However, we also now have a charcoal a pine resin. So this should also give us some options. Oh, there was something I wanted to say about the four kings. Yeah. Because the fight could take quite some time. Usually you want to rush those guys. Oh, I should also check the weapon. We now have Astoria's great sword. Which we probably can't carry. It doesn't look... It's okay, I guess. But it doesn't look too much like um, one of Aragorn's swords, to be honest. The long sword looks more like it. So we could make... Excuse me, uh, an argument for it, but I don't know. It's three C scalings, but I need 14 faith, so I need four levels to actually use it probably. And then hmm. the scalings are okay of this weapon. I mean, it's a, it's definitely an option for later on. I know how well we can upgrade um, the other weapons. I also know that uh, fighting with this thing here is a nightmare. So. To actually make anything happen in the game, we need to defeat the Capra Demon. We um, defeated the Taurus Demon uh, last game, I think. And we'll probably continue with doing so uh, further in.
So when we defeat the Capra Demon, we can get um, the Ember that we need to upgrade the weapon to plus 10. Oh, I forgot something here. It's already down here. Am I just in... No, I thought for a moment I'm a total idiot. I mean, it looks a little bit uh, more weather beaten than usual. Also, we have 4k souls, which are quite a few level ups. We have access to. Uh, can't. No, we can't port. I already tried, uh, just for the lulz, I tried beating a uh, Quilug with a, with a starting weapon without leveling up much. I fought her some time, but uh, yeah, it made no it made no sense continuing the fight. Okay, now we need 400 more souls, and why do I need to go back? I need to go up. Well, the no is a normal way. Now we take the aqueduct shortcut, of course. We we'll talk oh, to this guy. I regret meeting you under such compromising circumstances. At least we both made it back unscathed. Oh, hello. Terrific to see us both in one piece. And pray that you never go hollow. Oh, hello. I so, I think to um, trigger his dialogue options, I need like at least 10 intelligence or something. Look at this the damage of this powerful weapon. We can actually two shot this guy and three shot this guy. I'm like a level 20, so yeah, pretty difficult. We could get this item over there because we have only 1800 souls to lose. I mean, it's annoying to see it every time, so we probably won't need it, or maybe we need it at one time. I think. Who is this? A fiend. I don't want to have you there. So, <laughs> as you can see, the bow here is probably my uh, highest damage weapon that I currently have. Now we have to make the leap of faith. The films also. There was a lot of jumping in Moria. Did I just shot him into the knee? <laughs> Quite funny. Oh, that was a knife. I was asked myself, what was the sound? Oh, the red. So we open the shortcut. By the way, they can drop humanity, which I would take in a heartbeat. Can't have enough humanity. We could also run around a little bit with soft humanity. Oh, there's a merch. Now we have 2k. Hmm. Now I'm a little bit unsure if we shouldn't be too far away. At least get the repair box. I hope I hit him. Well, not perfectly, but I think that counts. Look quite funny. Those people are standing there and they're not blocking. So. No, my friend. Actually thought I could one-shot him now. Spoiler, that's not the case. But if I hit him, <laughs> hit his head, I can get a crit. So now it, be now it becomes a little bit difficult, I think, because we have to kill the doggos. So 
don't want to deal with those. I have no clue how to fight the Capra Demon with a bow. I mean, it's possible, I guess. I see doing this. I don't. I just don't know how to deal with the two dogs um, on the stair because this is basically the biggest problem. Surviving um, the start. Wow. I'm basically. I'm dead. I'm dead. This should have not happened. He should not have hit me. That was not a good start. But yeah, that's what can go wrong here. You go into the uh, fight. And you just get really, really unlucky. Or maybe it rolled a little bit early. It was probably a reason for this too. <laughs> okay, that looked cool. Ouch. I need more item find for this to work. But no problem. We just go back there, find a little bit more souls. I can't use a bow at the beginning because I need to dodge the first attack of the Capra Demon. And it's very slow shooting. Dark Souls 3 bow is pretty nice. You ran up the stairs again. I need to get out of this view. Because it's annoying me. Did I just miss this? Oh boy. Dogs are really difficult to fight. You see how many hits I need with um, the broken sword. I'm not sure if I can beat the Capra Demon with it, so we probably will use a bow. I just need a little bit of damage and the arrows give me enough of it. Uh, now that I've seen how how low my damage is, I, I have to rethink my strategy for a moment. If I need like four hits for a dog, I mean four hits for a dog, there are two dogs that are eight hits. When sh It's difficult in this fight to land like eight hits, so... Maybe we have to switch to good old friend, Mr. Longsword. No, I'm actually sad that I didn't uh, pull out the other sword, but... Whatever. Probably have to go with this one. The straight sword isn't just powerful enough yet. So... Capra Demon, here I come, I guess. I mean, it's not upgraded yet, so... Okay, now we got at least this part alright. Come on, Capra. 
Okay, Pro Demon. Come on, two times in a row. That's not fair. We got this one, but uh, yeah, one hit I need to dodge it to uh, make this fight work. But it works better with this one. Needs two hits for a dog, which is still quite challenging. Better than four hits, I guess. Maybe I should have blocked one some of the hits. Block is always an option. Let's go real fast through this. It was really close. Arrow chisel. Me. Did it again. Oh, we still have an enemy left here. So let's continue. Oh, I still hit it. Good, I guess. Now oh, that that one uh, was much better. <laughs> that was not bad. button. Try to cancel it. Couldn't. Oh. Wow, that hit me. to those dogs, which would be annoying. Um, okay, let's get a little bit distance here. I need to heal really bad. Still one left. Okay. <laughs> It was far more challenging than it should be. So three hits when I don't dual wield it. I could try to block with a sword. I mean, I've, I've one try, probably lose all my stamina, but we could try. But three hits for a dog. Oh, that will be rough. Ouch. I need to heal. To heal. Let's make another round with the doggos. Get my souls back. Wow. Okay, now we are talking. Let's breeze a small breezer for a moment. With oh boy, that's a three hit combo. Haven't fought him for some time. Let's see if I we can bait him. Ah, too slow. And this should be enough. Could have rolled into it. Okay, let's try out this bow. Roll the better. I 
actually stuck, which I don't like. I need to get away from this dude, can we? Sometimes the directions are a little bit annoying. Oh boy, that was close. <laughs> He definitely really does this attack. We can get an attack in, I guess. Oh no, the camera. I, I, I put the blame to the camera. Oh. He's angry, I guess. Goodbye, Mr. Capra Demon. Now we have the key and we have beat him, which went better than I thought, but I, th I would say with the um, other weapon, with the broken sword, it, I wouldn't probably, it would have taken a few tries, I guess. The camera in this place is just so bad sometimes, because especially this tree. Uh, you fight like a boss, your heart is pumping and you see this. In, in some cases, and you can't see what the enemy is doing, which is so annoying. So it's ba basically a test of your mind. Much more than it's anything else. To be patient and listen to the sound cues, go seeing what's on, uh, going what's on. Fairly simple boss. We could already or start unlocking this door. No. We must go down here now with 10k souls, which I totally dislike. The reason why I totally dislike this is... Um, you can die here easily, but we have a bow, I guess, so it should work. Wow. There's an invisible wall. Where on earth is this? Of course, they didn't notice us, which is good. I hope I can now pass this wall. <laughs> how funny how they just both turn around. Come on, Dark Souls. I'm pretty sure I hit this. <laughs> Ouch. There's another enemy here. I'm not sure. I... Not used to the using a bow. There will be a lot of fiddling around with uh, Mr. Zoom in, zoom out. It's quite funny. No, not this guy. Could we please? I have to say, it fits quite good with a bow. Fight those guys. Prioritize the right guy, which is this one. It was the same weapon. Best weapon friends forever. Well, not forever, I guess. Another broken sword. Cool. So we have a lot of those. But, now that we have a bow, we can try to hit Mr. Doc. I hope it's not clipped. It is. Maybe this works. Okay. Would you please stop doing this? Well, we have not enough oomph. Oh, there's another dog. I thought he would be dead. Okay, so I was bugged for a moment. Take this any time. Also, look who's here. Another guy, but Strider, of course, have has seen. By the way, am, is my microphone activated? It is, okay. I'm always a little bit terrified that this is not the case. 
or that I'm too loud. This is if this is the case or the sound is not good, let me know. Oh no. I don't know how to fight Butcher Lady. Can't destroy this. Um, the question is, is, did she just fell down? That's weird. Moment. I have to tap out for a moment. I actually am surprised that this worked this bad. Pay attention. Ow. That was rude. Okay, we need some time. Really? 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 Oh boy, it'll be tough. Why can't I backstab her? It's weird. She's described as a woman, though. to get out of this. So, oh, this is better. Um. Ah, oh, no. Don't want to die here. We're already, by the way, dead. Be dead. So this works. There's another one here. Not sure if I should kill her. Because when you um, get her mask, if she drops it, um, we can get a, a very cool item. So don't know. <laughs> that looked funny. I, don't, I can't remember if there's just one dock here or two. No. Well, that worked. There's another dock. Can I headshot him too? I have to be careful now. Oh, I didn't. That was close. Now it becomes really tough. But we got it. We also have the Amber. We can use the Humanity just to heal. Don't want to have bad surprises, to be honest. We won't continue here for now. But we should free the Pyromancer, even though this will most likely trigger our friend up there. It didn't. Please, you must help me. I'm a little bit paranoid. I will help you, my friend. I see that you are in quite a pickle to quote our friend, Sigmeier of Katarina. Thank you. I would have been a sucker without you. Been in the line. I started to think. Thank you. Thank you, dearly. <laughs> 
Protect his perspective, it's better, I guess. Like didn't notice. Oh, this oh, is the uh, pyromancer. <laughs> also, quite funny. Oh, hello there. Oh, hello there. <laughs> I'm so happy that this guy's fine, thanks to me. So, get away from here. Think about taking a homeward bone. What was the bonfire we used? Filing, I guess. Yeah, we need to go to the smith. Because we have uh, all the stuff that needs to be done. I mean, I'm an idiot. I could have taken the bonfire, but okay. We hadn't any esters left because I... Let's say I didn't uh, solve the problems or the challenges of this area too well. So we can make a lot of level ups. But we first go with 12k souls. Hope we don't meet surprises. By the way, I think I have still the uh, fire sound in the background on. Could maybe deactivate it. Maybe it's annoyingly loud for you. I hope not. left we have rung we have already defeated the gargoyles also this guy is now here well i see you made it out yeah i, I made it out safely too i have my pyromancy is a great swamp so i can use commanders with a bit of care oh yeah by the way uh, i can share my spells with you i think you have a knack for it all you need are the materials i'll be pleased to help you ah and unless you find the magics unsafely yeah wonderful I'm sure that... You know, no, I like... Uh, my, my friend is a wizard, so... I have nothing against magic. <laughs> a flame from the Great Swamp. Now you're a fully-fledged pyromancer. Well, let's get started right now. So, now we can purchase, like, some spells. It could help us, but Aragon wouldn't use those, I guess, so... We won't go this path, right. but it's Be nice so to have it. I have talked to this guy. So we need to go. Am I? Yeah, I'm right here. <laughs> That's also very funny. Oh, hello. My guests have finally arrived. I will be departing with them shortly. So, I'm afraid I will be saying goodbye soon. It was a pleasure. Oh, miracles, I presume. Mm, that's the last chance to at least purchase a healing spell. We said maybe a healing spell. Because Aragorn uses like herbs and stuff to heal, so maybe he should have a healing spell. But 4k, that's quite an investment. I know that you find it somewhere too, but I can't remember where, so we will see him later in the game again, I guess. In the 12 phase, which is also quite possible. Five K for the for this talisman, but we we stay with the um, Sauroland and uh, not with with the normal one. Come again. Don't want to invest Be too much. Oh, miracle! An undead mission. Regrettably, I cannot share that with you. But you are my pupil. Perhaps if you show your faith. Okay, what does this do? I have actually no clue. But uh, no, thank I'm you. That may be difficult. You will. You have a secret mission, and you let me pay for the information, and then 
I mean, your boss, so to say, is right over there. <laughs> she can hear us. <laughs> this is my favorite one. I like, I love his dialogue. Yeah, yeah, I agree with you. What do you say about... How confident are you in your mission? Yes, yes. And what is... What is about this guy? It's a bit strange. Did you just get that he wants to... Uh, or he sells a secret information about your mission to just some random stranger that ran by? Yes, yes, I see. Hmm. What does hmm? he have to say? What have we here? You look awfully raggedy. Times are grim. <laughs> That's At fitting. Strider. My name. <laughs> dare me, my lady, like that. You might scare her off for good. You're probably right, but I will talk to her anyway. If you are undead as well, then we've no time to fraternize. I have my mission, and you no doubt have yours. You must not let this curse overcome us. Did I not explain the urgency of our tasks? Or are you so uncouth as to lack such judgment? By the looks of you, I should think not. To be fair, I know how sh I uh, know how she mission the mission ends. Who are you so uncouth? By the okay. At least we went through the dialogues, which is always quite interesting and funny at times. So let's continue with our broken sword. Now we have the power to upgrade it even further, which will be needed. We won't get, we won't get, or we do not get much out of the scaling. Plus 25. Wow. Just passing by. But if you really want. Wow, why didn't he, sh why didn't I shoot? That's weird. Well, it worked out anyway. So, now we are back to good old Andre of Astora. I what hope so. Sure, why not? Here, take my this amber, my friend. You won't be disappointed. I can hardly wait to get started. Reinforce weapons. I need to... Um... My... What is it called? Inventory, I guess. Oh, yeah. I want to modify it. We have enough large titan. We have five. So this is still our best weapon. So I would upgrade this uh, definitely. We can also go the war route. Huh. I'm so in... I'm very I'm not very confident in upgrading a broken straight sword to be honest. So we will upgrade the bow first. I mean, it's one shard. Now I have three. So sad. Reinforce weapons. So the broken straight sword plus six appears here. Which is quite complicated if you think about it. But that's how Dark Souls 1 handled it. We can also upgrade the bow even further, make him better. DS to S. We already have an S scaling on it, huh? That's quite good. The problem is um, now we need our, we need our precious large Titanite shards. But to be fair, I needed to get it to get to plus ten anyway. 
So how much do we need? We need two, then we have plus nine. And the last one could be three. So we need five more large Titanite shards. And the same treatment. Our bow also needs the same treatment. We can't buy a large Titanite yet. We have to find it, but I think it's also not necessary. So we have some uh, options here. Also, we could level up our character a bit. I mean, we could invest two, then we could use... No, I don't waste two level ups when I'm so low on damage. We need damage. A lot of it. We just boosted our damage by just a tiny little bit. 105 damage with our straight sword. Wow. It was so expensive and brought so little. The question is, go we through the catacombs. We don't need to. They are optional. Let's test our newly improved sword. What it can do to these guys here. We one-shot this guy. Okay, that is actually an amazing improvement. Can you imagine I needed like three back steps when I started with this weapon? No, nah, we're quite fine. We got a light crossbow. Oh yeah, I forgot an item. Could get the light crossbow earlier. But whatever. Still have no clue where to what to do next. We also test our friend, Mr. Bow. Not bad, I think if I would have hit the head, we could have uh, could have seen better results. Oh no. I need to get out of this. It worked. We could go to the asylum, get the other shield that does it's good against magic damage. Mm, what else could we do with 2k? Is this already level up? No, I think I, think I, need, all, uh, I need 3 already for level up. So, let's not even level up. But, I forgot something very important. I mean, it's not that important. Maybe I should pop a soul for the other thing. So we can get the upgrade box, the armor box, and the... Oh, not the armor box. We don't need the armor box. Who upgrades armor on Dark Souls 1? Of course, you can do this when you have nothing else to upgrade, but... Um, I won't. So, not sure where to go next. So many options we have now. So the weaponsmith box is nice to have. I would also have the rep repair bo uh, rep repair box. That's the name. What do I do with the repair box? So let me think about it for a moment. Do we need it? I mean, technically. Technically, I want to have it. Okay, if we go down to Blytown, 
We won't fight this guy, by the way. Uh oh. Okay, that worked out. Actually, curious how well I can now find my three little friends here. And two shots, that's much better. Oh, a toxic. Um, Moss against Toxic, which is also very Aragorn-like to have... Actually, how much damage? 31. That's kind of cute. Could be 3. Please not block my vision. Well, another one of those. Now we have a little bit of... Um, Wow, that dodged. Did you see this? It was kind of impressive. And a normal purple moss clump, which is good. There's this little trap part here. Also, I need to buy arrows. I just... Uh, let's see. Hmm. That's not good. We only have 100 left. I bought like 300 at one point. Well, let's say you need a lot of arrows with with Aragorn and a broken sword as weapon. I won't go for shenanigans here. Oh, it's high frames. That's funny. I should wait a little bit. Could be a little bit dangerous, oops. I think there's still one left. No. I died here the first time when I uh, played casually through the game. I still play casually through the game, but you know what I mean. When I first time played it, didn't know the game. Boy, that was a bad surprise for me. I still need more enemies to kill. I thought this would be like enough for uh, the 2k that are needed. We could cheese the and the Titanite demon, but I don't feel too confident. I actually thought this guy is still alive, but it's just his rectal physics that are wiggling his body. I'm out of here. Dude, stop shooting. So resetting the enemies, we go for another one. Kill at least I want to have one more moss clump, just in case. Quite loud. He's in range, didn't expect that. Yes, nice. Take the other guy because it's just around the corner. Two. And if I think about it, 
I also need souls for the repair box. And I need arrows. Oops. Panic. Why is there a stone in the way? Should I hit this? Good. Of course, I hit the iframes. Uh, 150 is not that much, and we don't have the crest yet. I think with some juicy arrows, we could actually cheese a little bit. What's going on here? It could be really dangerous, but I can kite them with a bow. Oh, that's good. Really good. That was fast. Could also open this fog gate here. I didn't know what en yeah these enemies do. I want to fight them. There's also this funny tree here. Blocks the path, which is quite interesting idea of this game. We need to two hand this. Yeah, as you can see, of course, in a in a stride up challenge, we need to use the broken sword because in the books he carries it around. For those who don't know, and it does no damage, and it's like plus eight already. Will be really tough, but. He also uses a longsword, so I can use this too. And he uses a bow, which is currently my most powerful weapon. I know what to do with this guy, though. I think they're very slow, so I can kite them. Oh boy. Question is, can I buy more arrows from the souls this guy's dropping than I need to kill him? But I assume that is the case. <laughs> that was kind of cool. So, um, we still need more arrows. There are more of those guys here. There's a knight, uh, the elite knight armor over there. But I, I don't know if we need this. Knights are not really a thing in Lord of the Rings. It's, it's too ancient for this. Because Strider, with his sharp eyes, can see that this is a trap. I knew that this would happen. But I went for it anyway. I hope there isn't... It does work. Nice. Oh no, he goes... Okay. So we have two... I think there's still one more guy here. We also get a little bit of moss clumps. We can hit those guys. Wait, where's the hitbox? They don't have a hitbox when they're laying down. That's interesting, I didn't do that. I mean, there's still one dude left. We won't, we don't want to fight with those three guys at all. Hey, that, that had to hit. Only have 60 arrows left, so we probably won't fight the big guys. Get the armor. And say I'm out of here, I guess. Because I don't want to waste too many arrows. Even though... Yeah, now he's using the shield. I mean, they give good souls. And arrows like 10, so I get... 
they give 500. That's bad. No way. I can't. Oh, oh, this could be my doom. He slowed me. Yeah, that was bad by my side. He slowed me, I couldn't roll. And then I was stuck in the roll animation. That's, um, yeah. I'm dumb. Should have just gotten away. But I don't. I can't fight him with a normal sword, so now I have to walk again, right? But that's part of the challenge, I guess. I'm looking so forward to um, when we finally get to the interesting part and can upgrade this weapon to, I don't know, a fire weapon or something, plus five. And then we, do, we can make like, I don't know, a couple hundred damage with it. Isn't that much in late game, but it's better than, that, uh, than this. Just look at how many hits I need for this tree guy. This is one of the easier enemies in the game. Need like, I don't know, eight hits. It makes fighting bosses and stuff quite difficult. But we have, of course, a bow. And that helps a lot. Also, thank you, camera. Okay, no item drop. I have still 50 arrows left and I have some spare arrows, um, feather arrows and stuff, so should be okay. Also, I should kill this dude first. No. Oh no, he's not locked in. It was a lot of damage, but I think it was a counter hit. No item drop. What's wrong there? I know that that's another dude hidden here. Good friend Aragorn would have seen this, of course. So let's continue. I where did, where did I die? Some somewhere down here, I guess. First of all, we have to not die to all those um, friendly tree people here. I mean, usually I wouldn't hurt ants, but to be fair, they are quite aggressive. I'm not sure if they are actually ants. But we get a little bit of a uh, little bit more moth this way, which is also, I would say, a pretty Aragon thing to do, like. Collecting herbs to heal and cure poison and wounds and stuff. So that makes totally sense. So I won't fight those guys again. I think they are still... Actually, while we are here, we could do the boss of this area, but... Um, actually, with a bow, it's fairly easy. But I need arrows first, so... Now we have the, at least the resources to get more arrows. I don't know if the smith sells arrows, though. If not, we have to walk quite a bit. Let me think about this item. Is this a poise? This is a poise item. Would be nice to have. The wolf ring, I guess. Of course, Aragorn can see it from here. <laughs> no, I just know the game quite well, so that helps a lot. We also won't fight this guy because I don't have the damage for it. It would take like forever. Hope I can get past him and he is nice. But it looks like it. Wow, that was actually a really good shot. <laughs> Thank you, Blacksmith. Well, hello again. Good raid, the message. No, but uh, do you sell arrows, my friend? You do. Ten, so we need a lot. But before we do this, I want to have the repair box. I don't know if I re would really need it. 
but let's get it. Large arrows are too expensive. That are not in our budget, even though we have some, some of them too. But 170 arrows should help us out for a while. Where do we go next? I'm not sure if I really want to go down um, the catacombs. Not catacombs, what's it called? The depth. So, where can we go else? We could go to Quilak. Try killing her. In my darkest dreams, I would go through the catacombs, actually. So, go to the uh, cemetery, Farthing Shrine. Because there's the smith that I need to bring this weapon up to uh, fire, or make all of this weapon a fire weapon. We could try how this works. I'm not very confident in this with this character. But I know this, I knew this skip. I don't know it anymore, to be honest. I haven't done it in such a long time. I know that you can drop at some places and you get down to him fairly easy doing so. Also, Perry just one-shots him, which is amazing. When I started with this weapon, it took me like five parries to kill one of those. In this universe, Aragorn also has the ability to iframe, which is good. Always fun killing those guys. Um, now we tried. We, I tried the cemetery. I think I wouldn't say I'm confident in my killing power. We also go to the. But do I need it? No, not right now. So many good items in this game. Really well placed. One of the biggest strengths of Dark Souls. I mean, we could also kill Quilak. No, they're gone. Talk to him. Okay. So nice foreshadowing. Question is, can we kill those skeletons? I hope. How did I miss this? Oh no, that's really bad. I would love to... Could we please... Okay, this weapon is not ideal to kill a skeleton, so my confidence isn't that high. Did I just block? That was quite... Can we stop hitting me all the time? Come on, guys. What's wrong with you? You're skeletons. Go a bit slower. Also, on only have a broken sword. Oh, boy. No, I'm not very confident. If I can find the skip, maybe. We don't have much, uh, many souls anyway. But those guys are tough. Just imagine a level fu uh, full of those. And they always revive because of necromancy is going on. To think about it, it's quite a lot of the rings. 46 damage to those guys. Whew. That would be rough. That would be really, really rough. Could have fought that better, but... Usually when you go here, you just one-shot those skeletons. Or at least two-shot them. I mean... We could try the... I did it again. Forgot to clean up my inventory. That, that will be bad at some point. Let's try what the uh, this sword does. Maybe we should get some souls. Oh boy, that's bad.
quite funny when you're the bow's best weapon. <laughs> Killing skeletons with a bow doesn't sound really efficient in of itself. A scimitar, oh, that's interesting. So do we make the quick run through it? I mean, I hate not collecting weapons. I need to kill the necromancer. I don't see, I don't see this happening. Going this route now. I really don't see this happening. Excuse me, sir. I'm out of here. Binoculars. Would be a more a shy thing, so we don't need those. Like I don't know if you guys watching know the game quite well. But just for comparison, if you just look at this sword, it deals 80 damage. My broken straight sword plus 8 does 72 damage. So I upgraded eight times. And it still does. It still does um, not even as much as a normal, not upgraded weapon. And this weapon, the long sword, is not that great either. So if we compare that to the weapon I just collected, it does more de It does almost more damage than both weapons combined, unupgraded. So if I would change, what is it? We would also get a much better scaling. But. Yeah, I don't know. How much damage do we do? 80 plus 38. I, I think I really need to start upgrading this weapon. Question is, where do I get the souls for this? Hmm. Always interesting, but difficult at the same time. I can't I can fight Kree like with a bow actually, but the area's big enough. If I play well. We could try getting a better bow, then I would be would feel stupid for um upgrading this bow. I think our best option right now would be upgrading the uh so maybe we should go back to the forest and kill the butterfly because it gives like a lot of souls Have any boss souls by the way? No, we don't have yet Do we have, we have one titanite shard we need like I don't know what the number is one plus one I guess two times two Would be six Last three, nine. Is it nine shards to upgrade it to plus five? That would be in gold, almost 8k. So 7,200. Uh, Don't have the material for the red upgrade pass, and I can't remember where to get it. So a lot of bad news going on here. I mean, screw it. Screw the 400 cells. We try running through. I did it in the past. I know how to run to basically through to Nito. At least I knew at one point. I didn't rest, of course. That was close. problem I have is just that I need to I need to use this lever I need to kill also this other dude oh boy so I could run past him easily that didn't that wasn't a huge success We have to quit out one time. Shit. Let's reset the level 
for a moment and the position of these all the skeletons. Let's hope that I don't eat a fireball. Ah, that's that's a pity. My weapon should have changed my weapon. Also, we got a lot of souls. Oh, where do we get those? Oh no, I didn't rest at the bonfire. Oh, that's that's not good. So we have to walk again. I tried to attack him, but I thought, oh no, I still had the bow equipped. I couldn't interrupt his fireball. Maybe I should have gone for the dodge. But this time... I mean, I could... Well, if we are just here... We could we could at least get the asylum key, so now I guess. Hooray! I forgot that I'm playing at 60 FPS because usually you can just roll from one thing to another. My orientation just so bad in this place. Try it again. Let's take the sword for a moment and try to try to do the best. Make the best out of it. Oh, he's back. That's interesting. Let's see what he has to tell. Uh, oh, you again? Me? Uh, I've become separated from my lady. I've scoured mm, sure. you far, but no sight of her. There's a guy who sells. Milady, or tell strangers life. about their secret mission for souls. You are 100% trustworthy, my friend. I really like that. Uh, this guy is so strange from the beginning. You can't put your finger on. But there are actually a lot of hints that show that this guy is actually up no good. Up to no good. I think that was, that's the correct phrase. So now... Let's try it again. My plan is not to die this time. One of the best plans I ever had. Also, avoid the skeleton. I think we don't need to go with this sword. But it still does not do a ton of damage. I think club weapons are quite good against skeletons, but could be wrong though. So, I don't know how many hits I would need for the Necromancer. No, oh, no, that's bad. I need, I need the time. Okay, let's say. Let's say we won't kill this dude. We need full health. Hope it works. But where do I have to go? Was it like here? No, it was not here. Got to quit out really fast. Can't rem I can't remember where it was. You have to just rush through one door and then fall down and then you are basically there. This is, by the way, the... Um, the S-Fix version, and I play on 60 FPS. So every time I meet a, a small slope or stairs, I could get stuck a little bit there. Is there any bonfire I can walk to down here? No, covered in bonfire, right? 
Yeah, the bonfire before Nito is probably. There's a covenant down there. Too, if I think about it, I think you can warp there after you beat Nito because uh, the air this area gets a bonfire. It was close. So it's so hard to see where you have to go. It's so dark in here. Maybe it's not as dark on the screen for you, but we'll see. Rolling. Oh, that was a moment. I was pretty sure I'm... I'm stuck there. It's also Mr. Necromancer. Where do I need to go? Not in here. Are you sure? Excuse me, sir. I'm uh, also in a hurry. Oh. We're in bad. Oh no, I'm back here. But probably have taken a lot of funny enemies with me. Could you please stop hitting me? I'm probably dead. Um, that I, I can't remember where to jump down. You can jump down to this place over there, but I can't remember the where to do this. I think it's you have to go up a ramp and then you have to go right. Then you can basically just drop from one, one thing to another. I would try again. Well, it would be amazing to um, be able. By the way, I thought about warping, but of course I can't warp anyway. I don't have the Lord Vessel yet. But whatever. We find this out. I remember that you can do it, but I can't remember where. It's only a where question, not a if. I did it before, but. Where was it? Maybe I have to check a YouTube video. It's, I simply just forgot, but maybe kind of funny finding stuff like this out. Wow, shooting with fireballs already. That was also quite funny. No. Oh boy. was not here. Where on earth was it? Let's quit out for a moment. Let's just quit out. Think about it for a moment with that the skeletons. Where? I know this is a regular way by the way so I could do stuff but it was possible to drop there. You can drop down on this thing I think. Would you please? Stop hitting fireballs at me. Uh, shooting fireballs at me, that would be amazing. Also, I have to navigate them in this maze now. Mm, that's sad. No, now it becomes dangerous because I'm um, can hit me with a fireball still. Oh. 
No. Mm. Missed one input. I simply missed the input. I can't remember. Where was it? You can... There was this ama amazing drop. But it could be that it was quite early on, this, on the stage. I think it was at the bridge somewhere. I simply can't remember. I did it so many times. In the past, but I can't remember. I can skip basically the whole level very easily. If you have the healing... Survives the fall damage, but this shouldn't be a problem. And I can't, simply can't remember the skip. It wasn't even that tight one, but uh, nice. Go here, do this, quit out. Now I. Now I, of course, hit the quit out. Okay. I could try to kill this dude. Hey, come on, dude. I guess every skeleton always needs to hit. You roll up here, oh, come on, let me just watch for a moment. Got oh, three skeletons there. What's wrong with those skeletons? Why are they all standing at the door? Oh, I'm dead. Ah, such a pity. Couldn't get back there. Should have quit out. Maybe I should uh, just... Uh, I just should look it up. And I know it works. I can't find the spot. Because I'm... So many skeletons are shooting at me all the time. Which is quite annoying. A little bit trial and error here. It would help me so much if I could skip this part and get to the um, undead smith. I don't know what he sells, so maybe he sells large titan, but I don't think so. He sells um, green titanite, if I'm not mistaken. I, uh, I rarely use the um, the what's it called? rarely use the uh, the fire passes the occult ones and so on so not too familiar with those so let's just quit out real fast we have a little bit more time to think about it. I also want my, my juicy souls back, which is probably on. Of course. Okay. Come on. How do... How well does all the, Do you guys track? Wow, still hitting me. <laughs> well, The funny thing is, this guy will just get up again. Ah, that's annoying.
No souls. Yes, that was it. Now we are very far. This is already the grave thing of Nito. Always underestimate how incredibly far those skeletons can jump and how well they trek. Just reset for a moment. So we found it. I think it wasn't the ideal position for it, but at least I had some time to do this. So now. I have to find the way down, which I can't remember. Let's check it here, maybe. All through this fog gate. Also drop uh, down here. Wow! Can't remember where the drop here was. You can drop down here somewhere too. Okay, just get out of here. We need a little bit more time to think about where to go next. You can drop one, fur down, uh, one, one part further down, but I need to drop from above. Not one hundred percent sure, but I think you can drop down here. But what would be the regular path? I don't need to go to the complete bottom side. That's amazing. So those, those explosive heads, <laughs> funny enemies. I was really scared, scared of them when I first came in and thought, what, what, what is, what are those guys? Can't remember the regular pass. I think, would think, yeah, it must be somewhere here. It's not the case. Oh, I don't have activated this one. Isn't here a chamber or something? Oh, that was... That was what I was to do. I'm not sure if it is smart to drop down here. It is totally not. Because I don't know the uh Yeah, that's a really bad place to die. I can't remember where to go here next. There's so many skeletons here. I need to drop down or something. Where but where was it? I just can't remember. Maybe I need to I need to watch a let's play of this. <laughs> Can't remember the path. I mean, I could find the the elevator. I know where the um, where what's it called? The lever for it is for the um, bridge. But I can't remember which one it was. It's like the staircase with this hole in the middle, and there you have to drop it at a certain point, and then you're good. You can drop to the bottom from there, basically. I'm not even sure if you can drop from here. Oh 
boy. Those stutes. So annoying. Especially getting past this bridge with the necromancer on it is uh, a very fiendish task. Let's reset the skeleton. Maybe I kill the necromancer here, because having two necromancers to deal with is probably even more annoying. Wow. So now we can kill the skeletons. Which as you can imagine helps a lot. Mm. I hate when this is happening. So annoying. Wow, that was close. Thanks camera. So where was it? I think I have to put here. There was an item in there and it's also a trap. Have to go here. Yes, that's that's the way. Now we um, turn the bridge around, which is good. Now comes a very much difficult part. Which is this dude here, but we let him alive. Ouch. But yeah, this, this is basically the place I want to be. Let us quit out really fast, so we don't have to deal with all those guys, and then we just instantly heal when we are back. I know it's a little bit cheesy to do this, but I don't need to... I'm not supposed to be here anyway. There's another necromancer. Cool. Now... Green Titanite Shard, which is also great. Quit out again, so we don't have to deal with skeletons. And other stuff, because down there it's really dangerous, and those... High damage, high DPS... Undead reels are... The pun intended, rolling around there. And now... Just heal up, because it's scary. We have this amazing cutscene. And this is the dude who can upgrade our weapon to fire. Also the dwarf. Looks like a giant dwarf from the proportions. A, a giant undead dwarf. It's basically a shortcut. Be gone with you. You'll spoil my focus. What a weird secret, and it's really hard to find this guy too. Because if he doesn't do this, can't enter. So. What's that thing? Need some smithing, then produce me some wares. Oh, I need Dream Titanet. So we could make our weapon a straight. So we would do 104 damage with it. That's not very convincing, to be honest. Not sure if this is a smart thing to do. Also, we only need to bring this weapon. I thought it was like a plus 10, but of course, lightning is plus 10 because you can um, increase fire to chaos further. Mm, that's a pity. Uh, wasted some titanite char uh, large titanite shards. Mm. You can still farm them, so it's not a problem, but 
Would be amazing still. We have plus 27. <laughs> wow, that's so, so little. And the damage scaling is not going to be much better. We already have like 30 strengths or something. Uh, dexterity. 40 soft cap. So it just won't be much more. It makes no sense to wield this weapon from this pass. So we probably will need a lot, a lot of stuff. So we go for the fire broken straight sword, I guess. And we can also upgrade it ourselves. And we need green titanite shards, which is amazing. Hmm, he only sells normal, that's normal ones, that's bad. But we can farm them quite easily in Blighttown. If you can kill those uh, leeches with one hit or two, I would say this would be possible. So we purchase another 100 arrows, because we need a lot of arrows. They want to continue here, that's also another interesting question. Now I can at least enter his uh, black, this blacksmith's um, place on this side, so that's good. But we will we go back to Filing Shrine. Maybe I should have upgraded the other weapon too. I don't know. Always a tough call. Let's test our new broken fire sword. At least we found the once we found the shortcut. So now, again, I know where it was. Well... Okay, that was weird. Ouch. Yeah, not fully convinced, especially against Quilak. Quilak has fire resistances, so... What we need to do, uh, to do is... We need to upgrade our weapon. And we need titanite stuff for it. We need to upgrade our fire sword even further. To maybe make a decent amount of damage. But against Quilak this all won't help too much. Oh boy, really difficult. So we could try... I really need a lot of souls. But that shouldn't be a problem. We could try the butterfly for souls. We could try... Those very powerful mobs, we could cheese them into the, into the abyss. It would work, I guess. We hit her at uh, the head. Now we can one shot them.
He has some souls. And this guy has dropped something for me, which is good too, I guess. triggered all the guys from above, but that's no problem too. Feels like a bit like a downgrade. The fire, the fire resistance makes it not that great yet. So this is another shard, so we can upgrade the longsword. I, mean, I should take everything I can get here and then just pop a few cells. Fair enough in the game. Well, headshot, I guess. Can we hit this guy? We can, but they dropped nothing. Kick him out of it. Now I have to go back here. Oh boy, that was stupid. But I, w I really wanted to kick him, but I missed the input. Else, it's all about why not shooting? Shoot him with a bow. I want to do this one. Sometimes, if you press the other too too, too early, you miss input into this. Oh, that doesn't work. I think it works in the other version. What does it? I don't know. Ah, that's so sad. Not being able to kill this guy like with one or two back steps is the most annoying thing ever. We still got the souls, I guess. Not that big of a deal. No way. I really didn't hit him. Wait a minute. Could we? Thank you. Well, let's say the aiming could be imp still improved. Oh, a rapier, nice. Get our revenge for this guy here. I 
hate Windows M. Could we? Thank you, game. Oh, come on, game. That's stupid. That's really stupid. Just lock him in. So tough to fight this guy with a bow. Plus he's blocking with the stupid small shield all the time. Not a fan of it. But we need the souls anyway. This is basically the fast travel back to bonfire. At least I can s sell it as this. <laughs> the big ones we can just give kill them with one shot, which is amazing. Smaller ones uh, give me some trouble. Uh, trouble. We also could get some uh, titanite shards. I think I have not collected everything there is to collect. In the uh, light town area. We kill those reliable dudes first. No way, I missed it. Those are far easier to kill. Those are not as tough, but this dude here. I always forget that. Okay, finally we got smarter. So this is a little bit of, um, these are four shards. Three. My mass is really good, <laughs> especially when I play Dark Souls. Oh, that's there's a shard for free, which is amazing. And, uh, shall we kill the other guy? I mean, it's souls. You know, the most efficient thing to farm, but oops. Did he drop something? No. I mean, we're playing a dex character, so the boulder side sword is actually quite. Uh, it would be an interesting option. Also, I should now um, think about clearing my inventory a little bit, sorting it a bit, putting stuff that I don't need into the bottom left box. Because there's a lot of stuff in it that uh, I won't use. But if I want to go to Quilak and to Blytown, I shouldn't rest here because I can just bonfire back to um, well, I don't know. to the other place. So upgrade it. Plus two. Now we can. Put Most weapons. So. No, I don't want to talk. I want to purchase an item. Can buy three, then we don't have enough souls, so we have to. Let's pop some souls. And five of those, I think they are quite good. 1k each. So this should give us some upgrades and some more. Uh, be able to purchase two more. Don't get yourself killed. Oh. 
Something like this should well. be enough. Should be still something left. Um, reinforced weapon. Thinking about it, I can also upgrade my stuff if I want to. Okay, we need two more titanite shards to bring it to plus okay. five at least. Two more. Two more would be 1k. I need 1000, so basically need this one. And a 200. I think this one is 200. Nice. Now we will well. see if I can. My mass is correct or not. My mass is not correct because I need two of those, right? Yes, of course. So I need 800 now. So one. Nah, no, it's. What a pity. I'm an idiot at times. Is this a 400? And let's go with just 1k. To modify this sword, we would need a large titanite shard, which we don't have, which is quite sad. Go get yourself. Oh, by the way, I wanted to use this item here. That's also the reason why I needed to be at the or around this for um, there for the smiths to upgrade it. So, what else do we want to do? We want to go to Blighton, I guess, which is crazy considering the amount of damage we do. But we at least now have this weapon. I still forgot to clean up my inventory. That's sad. So let's do this right now because it's really annoying to have stuff in it that we don't need. I assume we won't need this one anymore. No. We don't need a star of sword. We don't need another broken sword. We don't need the swy hander. Skimitar can be out. Mailbreaker can be out. Or thoroughly out. The repair can be out. S stock is out. Winged spear, we don't need this one. Light crossbow, won't use this one either. Probably won't use magic fireball, so we don't need this one either. My shield options are not bad. So I I will take it. Then we go no, that's the wrong direction for Blight Town. By the way, we have uh, the black leather armor, probably more fitting for Strider, I guess. Either the leather boots or we go with this. Is there a Do we have a hood or something like this? We have the thief mask, which is a hood. Maybe not the most rider like thing. Also the astral, I think. Great.
change the change the thing a little bit. something wrong okay there's also a thing I want to check because it stuttered at one point okay we dropped some or we missed some frames which is bad I don't know I don't know the reason for it I hope I hope the game runs fine in the stream. Also, there's another smith, which is this dude down here. Hmm? Well, this is unusual. You haven't lost your head. And more importantly, you're free. How on earth? Well, I shouldn't pry. I'm Rickett, didn't I? I was once an established smith. Look at me now. Can you believe it? Hmm? What is it? Have you? Oh no. Don't worry. I've no intention of escape. It's safe. I can't bear the thought of going hollow out there. Although, I must admit, there's not much to occupy myself. How about this? I could forge your weapons, albeit with rather minimal tools. I'll show you what made me the best in Vinod. No problem, my friend. So, this was uh, the the smith. He's he makes magic weapons. Which I think could work for um, Narsil and Andoril too. But I would prefer to go with the other stuff. We need the red tearstone ring. No, not good enough to use such a powerful item. By the way. of the toxic guy. So now let's see how well we do in Blight Town. Like before, we needed like... I don't know, like six or eight hits to kill one of those. Two hits, it's much, it's much better. Still not ideal, but I'll take it. I think it would, would take a while, but uh, can pretty confident now that we can beat Quilak. I'm not sure if I should fight Malt Manet Mildred. Malt Manet is it her? Is that her name? I don't know what her name was, but. Uh, I need to get invaded for this 
question is do I want this? I mean, her weapon is not really an option for me anyway, so I don't care too much. I would need the souls, I guess. Yeah, still stuff to collect. Could also try to find out um, what's going on with those leeches. We one shot him with a bow. That's amazing. Oh no, I lost my humanity. That's not good. That's fairly easy. Hmm. Let's hope for a little bit of drop, a uh, drop luck, which I don't have. But it's there's not much chance getting this with. Uh, with this little uh, item find I have. And we can get a humanity drop, which would help. Oh. Wow. Well, that didn't go as planned. I think I even survived the hit, but the poison killed me. <laughs> Should have healed though. Thought, what is there? Isn't there another one? No, I didn't see anyone. Can we kill this thing here? Yeah, you see how many arrow shots I need for this. The uh, longsword is far more effective against those dudes, it seems. Also try to not get poisoned on the way, which I assume would help. We are still over there. The only problem we probably will encounter is not enough arrows. As long as I can kill them with one shot, it's working, I guess. How did I overlook this dude here? Now this time... Could be a level up. Well, they have the chance to drop large titanite, like this one. We also find a bit uh, here and there. They also got large titanite and a green titanite shard, if I'm not mistaken. They can also drop green titanite, which I think if they drop it, they drop like three of it. Shouldn't. Do risky stuff like this. Because I'm poisoned, so trading hits, not a good idea. Yeah, this weapon. Do we need it? Probably not. up just in case because those things do some damage when they hit and 
has just a night and day difference if you have like 10 humanity. But they are uh, difficult for me to uh, maintain. Yeah, green titan archer. So we can upgrade our fire weapon, which is good and needed. Still not convinced, but let's hope um, the damage is okay. And we upgrade it a few times and make it actually work. But why not? Right now, it's weaker than the version we had before. I don't know what's in here. I think it's soul or something. The Trinity Humanity is set for that. It's so funny that we have another thing. We could get the Calamity Ring from here. Cool. We got some souls. It's not that hard to get if I remember correctly. Wow. Here it is already. Hmm. Not 